Not even going to cap to y'all boys. It's 45 degrees outside, bro. It's 45 degrees outside. Man, it's cold. It's cold, Nick. It's cold, Nick. I ain't even going to cap, though. I'm feeling pretty good this morning. <clears throat> it's still real early. It's like 7 in the morning. Would you look at the sky, though? Sun finally about to come out, nigga. Without no clouds in the sky. Hold on. I'm happy right now, bro. The sun is finally about to come out with no clouds in the sky. I'm happy, nigga. Now, basically, before I get into this video, what I want y'all to do is, man, I want y'all boys to watch this entire video, man. I want y'all boys to hear everything I got to say. Started off, man. How bad do you want it? How bad do you want it? Matter of fact, matter of fact, matter of fact. How bad do we want it? How bad do we want it, nigga? I'm telling myself I'm trying to succeed, but am I grinding for it? Trying. Trying, nigga. Trying ain't enough. We got to put in. You know how your coaches used to tell you put in, instead of putting in 100%, you put in 110%? Nigga, we putting in 150% out of 100%, nigga. You got to grind as much as you can. Now, me, I'm thinking like, man. Man, I know, man. I know it's going to take me a while to get these 1,000 subscribers. Or, well, nigga, I'm going to keep grinding. Want to know why? Because, nigga, that ain't going to stop me. I'm thinking like, man, I don't know, man. Should I just self-promote on other people's channel? I thought about it. I'm not going to lie. I thought about self-promoting. But then I realized, nigga, there's a better way to do this. Naturally, nigga. Like, you ain't even got to try, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just do what you love doing. And people going, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's the word for it? People going like uh, magnify <laughs> towards that, you feel me? No. How bad do you want it? Oh, you want it bad? Prove it. When you want something real bad, you got to prove it. When you want when you want to succeed, you got to prove it, nigga. But I guess what happened, though? Before, man, we're going to continue on this topic, but this is just a freestyle video. So the title... Might be just mixed up, bruh. I ain't even gonna lie. But guess what just happened, bruh? I was watching my boy, Team With Game, TWG. Go look that nigga up. His name Team With Game, TWG, bruh. He a um, small YouTuber. He got like 2,000, 2,820-something 2, subscribers or something, man. He got some around the number. He got 2,000. He got 2.8K, right? I'm watching this nigga video. He talking about some retrograde. Now, I'm already knowing retrograde, you know what I'm saying? The world already falling apart, you know what I'm saying? I'm already knowing the stuff going on is about to change for the better, but it could change for the worse for the people that ain't doing what they got to do, you feel me? Now, for the young niggas that's around my age watching this video, bro, in between, in between, let's see, 12 and 18, for everybody that's in between 12 and 18, nigga, hey, bro, we got to get on our junk. We got to do what we got to do. We the chosen. When niggas say chosen, we the chosen ones, bro. We gotta do. We gotta do, bro. We gotta focus. We gotta focus up, nigga. I know. Let me tell y'all something. I'll tell y'all this is just gonna be a freestyle video. Then we gonna get back on my nigga team with game talking. Nah, nigga. I was at school, right? I'm talking to this girl, man. I'm guessing she the school thought or something. I don't know, nigga. I don't listen to too much what people tell me anymore. I just gotta find out myself. You feel me? But look, so I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? I gotta give her a name. We're gonna call her um We gonna call her Grass. So you know what I'm saying? Grass, you know what I'm saying? She be tweaking sometimes. And grass be trying to bother me so much. Like grass will do whatever she can to bother me, bruh. You know what I'm saying? I tell her something. I tell grass something. Grass be tweaking, bruh. Like grass look at me. Hold on, I got some mail right here. Grass would look at me, and then she would just like, you know what I'm saying, give me that look. You feel me? I know she want to bother me so bad, and I be putting my energy into it. Hold on, let me go get my mama this mail, and then I'm going to continue this story. My bad job, boys. I had to go pass my mama the mail, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I had to go pass my mama the mail. But like I was saying, I was talking to shorty. She trying to bother me so much. She been trying to do everything to bother me. So this is the first time I actually put most of my energy into it. So I'm talking to her. Boom. Um. Throughout that day, she was talking about something. I was talking to one of my boys, you know what I'm saying? He and that mother like, hey, bruh, all these girls be trying to act like they thick. They all saying they thick. Even the skinny girls saying they thick. No. And I was like, yeah, man. Yes, right. And 
you know what I'm saying? Grass was one of the contestants, you know what I'm saying? But she's not skinny whatsoever. I don't know what to call her. We're going to give her in between thick. In fact, my nigga, we're going to call her thick. I mean, huh? I mean, that. You know what I'm saying? That. She was thick and fat. But I can't tell. So, boom, I'm talking to her at the end of the day, bro. She done took off her school shorts. And now she got some tight shorts on, right? So, she got some tight booty shorts on, right? I'm thinking this girl going to be gone. I'm about to go home, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to hop in the car. You know what I'm saying? If my build done wrong, it's time for me to go. I see her, bro. Dang, bro. She just look at me. I could tell she was looking at me hard, too. I'm looking at her. What's up, nigga? Boom. She look away. I'm walking. I'm talking to my boys. I'm like, yeah, man. Boom, boom, boom. I'm talking to something. I'll see you Monday on the tryouts, man. He like, for sure, bro. Hey, bro, take care of your ankle. Because, you know what I'm saying? I told the niggas I sprung my ankle. They like, take care of your son, nigga. We got four days. You can work that out. I was like, for sure, G. And so, boom, them niggas leave her, dap them up. I'm like, man, do what you got to do. Boom, she's sitting down with them booty shorts on, you know what I'm saying? So I'm talking to her. Now I walk past her because I thought I seen my mama car because I wasn't worried about this girl no more. So I walked past her, thought I seen my mama car. And it wasn't hers. It's a car that looked just like her. Same rims and everything. Same car, same model, all that. Like, nigga, her car, the lady car looked just like this. I'm telling you, I ain't look at the tinted windows, though, because my mom got the limbo tint. But I ain't look at the tent, you know what I'm saying? So I was just focusing on, you know what I'm saying? Hey, so boom, I walk past. I see that it's not her. I turn around. This girl told me some no, go home. Nigga, I'm talking about, huh? Go home. You know what I'm saying? She talking about, yeah, go home. Man, nigga, what I got to go home for? And so I'm just talking to her, but she keep trying to flirt with me. I'm talking about something. Why you took your school shorts off? She talking about something. Keep in mind, nigga, it was 55 degrees, nigga. I said, why you took off your school shorts? She talking about something because I can't. I don't know, man. She said something along the lines. I forgot what she said, bro. She just said because I want to or something. And I was like, nigga, it's cold outside. Like, it was like literally like 50 degrees outside, bro. She talking about something. No, it ain't. I'm talking about something. You took off them shorts so you could let them people see your little booty that you got. She was talking about something. It ain't little. Man, nigga. I started getting on the case. I'm like, what are you talking about? Like, you ain't got no type of cake. Boom. So, you know what I'm saying? She walking to the bus stop. You know what I'm saying? Because that bus finally pulled. I'm thinking this girl about to leave. Yeah, nigga. I ain't know she was coming back. Like, nigga, I thought she was gone. I wasn't even thinking about this girl. Like, literally, bro. Literally. But after that happened, bruh, you know what I'm saying? She was walking up to her bus. She's still talking to me. And then she reached out for the hug, you know what I'm saying? So she hit me with one of these. Y'all know how to be trying to get an arm hug, but it's like a full hug, but it's with one arm. See, niggas be hugging from the side like that. Well, she was trying to give me one of these, but with one arm. So, you know what I'm saying? Me being me, me being me, I slid in for the hug, right? I slid in for the hug. Now, I was trying to see what the booty was talking about. I ain't even going to lie to you. I was trying to see what the booty was talking about because I ain't really know for sure. Nigga, I remember this bitch, this girl, man, she ended up smacking her. That bitch jiggle like a mother. I ain't even going to catch to you. I was trying to see what it was like, though. So I was like, let me go ahead, check it out. Boom. I fake the hug. I get up behind her. Got left hand Fred in the building. I said, here. Nigga, that shit was hard. Nigga, <laughs> like, bro, that John was hard, nigga. I ain't even gonna care. That John was hard. Like, oh, God, that bit was rock hard. Like, nigga, I squeezed it. It felt like, I don't know, if I knew what plastic surgery felt like, it felt like something like that. That bit was hard. And then she tapped me on my arm. She like, boy, stop, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to give you a hug. You trying to grab my onions. Like, you play too much. And so, boom, she start walking some more. I think you I just go I think I just grab fucking rocks nigga a bag of rocks I'm talking about what nigga bag of rocks I'm talking about whoa so boom she trying to give me another hug I'm like bro you just want to dap I hit her with one of these <laughs> I'm like you just want to dap bro she dapped me up I'm looking at my boys I'm like, I'm saying, I'm saying what just happened no I didn't see what just happened though so, boom, that's the end of that, nigga. I just, I just wanted to be fucking, I just wanted to be petty, bro. Tell y'all the girl with the rock booty in my school, you know what I'm saying? That I thought jiggle like jiggle. Now, let's talk about teamwork game. Now, the retrograde. 
guess what I found out about the retrograde? Tingle Gang was telling me this. Retrograde is, he was telling me, retrograde is something going back into its original place or going back, right? So he was saying how Mercury gonna come closer and closer to Earth. This also means that we might be able, or not might, nigga, we're gonna be able to see that planet in the sky. We're gonna be able to see Mercury in the sky, right? I'm about to walk down here, some sun down here. I'm trying to see what I look like in the sun. There's some sun down here, and these people, y'all, I'm about to go see what's up with it. But yeah, nigga, he was telling us how Mercury, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's gonna have a retrograde and it's gonna get closer and closer to the earth, you know what I'm saying? I was like, bet, checking it out. And so then, I looked up retrograde. I got off his video because it was the end of the video. I got off, I looked up retrograde, and it was talking about, yeah, it's been going back. So I knew the nigga wouldn't cap about that. But then, I looked up Mercury retrograde, nigga. I looked up Mercury retrograde. Oh, here come the sun. Man, nigga, I looked up Mercury retrograde, bro. Ooh, wee. Fred. Mercury retrograde. Nigga, I looked up that retrograde, and then it was like, nigga's gonna happen between October 13th, Tuesday, to November the 3rd, Tuesday, nigga. And the reason it shocked me so much is because, look, November the... Huh? I was just talking to my mom, man. She telling me, ha! <laughs> but look, y'all boys. Nigga, Mercury, bro. They was talking about how the retrograde, nigga. Talking about the retrograde end on November the 3rd. Now, nigga, you do you know what November the 3rd is, nigga? If you don't, I'm about to tell you what. Nigga, November the 3rd is election day. Boy, I tell you about this world, nigga. Bro, November the 3rd is, nigga, election day. I ain't gonna lie, the sun get me right on. Mm -hmm. Sun, they ain't the sun big as fuck, man. <laughs> nigga, I'm sun. Nigga, what? The sun huge, nigga. Hold on, bruh. I swear, if y'all can see that through a camera, nigga, the sun big as fuck. Boy, the sun big, nigga. I ain't never seen the sun that big, nigga. That bit big, nigga. That bit look like this in my. Nigga, that bit big. Like, that, that bit huge. The sun fatty fucking the sun. <laughs> nigga. So look, y'all boys. Nigga, the end of the ratio grade is on November the 3rd, nigga. Election day. Nah, nigga, that shocked me so much to the point I was like, man, ain't no way. Nigga, November the 3rd is election day. I'm not gonna capture you. It is pretty cold. And I'm getting frostbite on my feet, nigga. I ain't even gonna cap. We about to go in the crib and warm it up a little bit. Back in the Fred Palace, you feel me? Frostbite go crazy. So look, y'all, boys. Like I was saying about the retrograde, bro. You know what I'm saying, nigga? It, it's on election day, and it's just so shocking. Like, what? Nigga, this, it's crazy how it ends directly on that day, election day. Nigga, that's, that's not a coincidence, though. Nigga, that is not a coincidence. That's just what the world is, nigga. The world is changing right in front of a nigga eyes, man. Ain't gonna lie. I feel pretty good in here, man. Ain't gonna lie. Feel pretty warm. Man, look, so that's the end of that. I don't want y'all boys to do y'all research on the retrograde, bro. I don't want y'all boys to find out what the retrograde is. Now, on to the next topic. Fighting your demons. You feel me? Fighting your demons. What I found out about fighting your demons is, nigga, I will be so motivated. And I was watching this nigga spiritual show. And he the one that put me on. I ain't even gonna lie. That nigga got me right. I was wondering why this was happening. But I couldn't find it from no research. So, nigga, this nigga telling me, wait a minute. This nigga telling me that, you know what I'm saying, fight your demons, you know what I'm saying, is when, let's say you have demons, you can have, um, like, any type of demons. You can have, like, um, food demons, like, addicted to eating some stuff that's not good for you. Like, you can have all types of demons. And one of the demons was, nigga, motivation. Nigga, I was so motivated to do a video. And then when I'm about to record the video... Nigga, I just felt something like, man, I ain't even motivated no more. I don't even want to do it no more. And then I didn't do the video, bro. Like, the video was about to get posted on YouTube. I was about to do a skit, like a little movie skit type thing. I, nigga, I lost so much motivation, nigga. And I was wondering what it was, and then it happened again. So I found out that that was the um motivation type thing. And so I faced that, bro. I was like, man, let me go ahead and film something. 
Then I found my junk. I still ain't end up posting it, but I found something. A little something for me. But besides that, bro, I just want to say, face your demons, bro. I'm going through it. You go through it. We all going to go through it. We all going to be good at the end. We all going to be good at the end, cuz. I ain't gonna lie, that jump scared me, cuz that jump jumped out on. I wasn't ready for those. But uh yeah, yeah, man, we got We all gonna be good at the end, bruh. Nigga, what is this shit falling up? Uh, yeah though. Hey, but look y'all boys. I ain't gonna keep y'all boys too long. I just want y'all boys to uh no days off. Keep it moving. How bad do you want it? Retrograde facing your demons, my nigga. I love y'all boys, man. Like, like y'all are family to me, bro. The few niggas that watch my video, I appreciate y'all niggas, bro. I appreciate the few niggas that watch my videos. Hold on, bro. Something about to give me some skull. Nigga, phone's about to collapse. We can't have those. We ain't waiting for four months for a phone. So, yeah, y'all boys. I appreciate the few niggas that watch my videos, bro. Y'all niggas make it. Oh, yeah, you nigga, y'all need to start eating cereal like these. I ain't no sugar in cereal, bro. Right? I ain't gonna lie, I like sugar cereal, but I know it's better for me, and I know what I'm gonna do. So, y'all boys, just do what y'all gotta do, man. Who persevering, nigga? Don't let nobody stop you. The only one that can stop you is you, bro. Feel me? This cereal, man. I'm trying to see what this cereal tastes like. I'm gonna mix it up. I like, you know what I'm saying, because ain't nobody been eating this cereal. I'm about to see what you're talking about. Man, you cereal, bro. I'm about to see what you're talking about. But of course, to top it off with some almond milk. I just had to get my message across. Y'all boys, I love y'all dudes. Family, man. Like online family. Some of y'all boys I know in real life. Bro. Some of y'all boys, it be niggas on point asking me about stuff at school. I be telling them what's up. They be like, every time I talk to them, they be talking about stuff that can improve their life. They be like, bro, just tell me anything that can help me out. And like, I be like, man, you sure you want to hear this? Because some niggas can't, don't, don't know they want to hear certain things. I'm about to eat the bit with a. So, you know what I'm saying? Measuring, spoon looking thing you think. But some niggas don't want to know certain information. Some niggas don't want to know this. So I'll be like, y'all niggas, show y'all want to hear this. And I'll be telling them what's real going on. Niggas be being shocked. And I'll be like, yeah, man, this is what it is. I know it sucks, but it is what it is. And I got me a table right here. I got me a TV. I'm about to put on a movie, eat my cereal, probably cook later. And, uh, nigga, just let the day flow like it normally do. I love y'all boys. I kept y'all boys for a little minute. Hopefully, people that made it to the end. Y'all boys enjoyed it. Say it to y'all people. Drawing deal. Lit. Peace out.